The fentanyl crisis continues to hit close to home and with thousands of students set to graduate soon, health experts are warning teens don't celebrate with drugs. CBS 4's Ted Scouten spoke with a man who knows firsthand about the dangers of fentanyl. He joins us now with that man's powerful message. I was about 22 and I took a, some medication, it was a pill, and it was laced with fentanyl and I overdosed. Brendan's drug of choice through high school and college was Percocet. He ended up buying it off the street. It nearly cost him his life more than once. I remember waking up in the back of an ambulance. Um, they told me that uh, I'd overdosed from fentanyl and I was, they used Narcan on me. Um, and then that, that didn't stop me at all. He ended up overdosing several times before saying enough. He's been sober for more than two years and now helps kids in recovery at the South Florida Wellness Center. With graduation parties coming up, he's worried about kids popping pills, aiming for a fun weekend. You never know what you're getting, especially going to party, have a good weekend. There's, there's no harm in that, you know? That's a, that's a lot of, that was my thought process, and that ended up with me overdosing about five times. And these pills that look like they are real pills have fentanyl in them. Most of them do. Overwhelming majority of those pills that are tested have fentanyl. Dr. Randy Katz is the medical director of emergency services for Memorial Healthcare. He sees an alarming increase in the number of fentanyl patients, and he worries that as kids celebrate graduation, it could get worse. There's nothing worse than having to tell a parent that their son or daughter is not with them anymore because of a, a silly decision they made uh, by taking a pill that was given to them by a friend. Katz and Brendan are urging people not to take illicit drugs in the first place, but note the importance of having life-saving Narcan nearby just in case. It's available at most pharmacies without a prescription. You don't have to be a drug user to carry it. You know, what if your, your friends, you know, they get into some drugs and it has fentanyl in it and now there's no life saver. No, there's just no life saver. And the Narcan is a life saver. Without Narcan, I wouldn't be here. And with all those graduation parties coming up, Memorial Healthcare is hosting a town hall meeting about fentanyl. All the key players are going to be there. If you'd like to join in, you can go to our website, cbsmiami.com, and we'll link you right to it. In Hollywood, Ted Scout, CBS4 News.